Hey guys, here's a quick tutorial on how to farm illusion remotes. Illusion remotes are needed for a lot of things. You will need between 2 and 300 to upgrade your seal. You will need between 50 and 100 per lesser essence that you need to upgrade. You will also need uh, illusion remotes for the greater essences, etc, etc. So how to farm them and how to get some quickly. You will get a few from certain Nightmare Rift achievements. You will get some from the Nightmare Rift daily quest that you get. And you have a chance for them to drop out of Nightmare Cages. Those are the boxes that you get from Nightmare Rift stages. You will get one box each 10 stage of the Nightmare Rift. So if you want to farm those modes really fast without having to do 24 hours a day Nightmare Rifts and hope for a drop of the cages, here's the way that I did it. The way I farmed my modes is by using my alts to do the daily quest every day. So all you need is an alt at least level 15. Then you need to go on the little island between Silverwood and Freemarch. Here is the exact location. Here you will find a story quest that you can pick up. That quest has no level requirement, you can pick it up as soon as you are able to leave the starting zone. You will however need to be level 15 later on to enter the instance, but you can pick up the quest as soon as you want. So after you picked up the quest, you will need to gather 22 quest items from Nightmare Rift mobs. So go to any Nightmare Rift that you can find, in any zone or level, it doesn't matter, and kill Nightmare Rift mobs until you have the 22 quest items you need. The quest items can be looted on the mobs on the ground, but they can also be looted in your rift bag. You will need to kill between 10 and 20 mobs to finish this quest. Now that you have finished your quest, you need to go back to the island to hand it in. After you hand it in, you will get your first daily quest. The daily quest you are looking for is Nightmare 1 Walking Terror, where you need to kill 16 quest mobs. You will also get another story quest called Rapid Eye Movement. This quest will allow you to enter the Nightmare Training Ground. You will need to be level 15 to enter this dungeon. If you are not level 15, use Insta Adventures to level up quickly and then come back. If you are level 15 or higher, just enter the training ground. Inside you will have the power-ups, same as in the Nightmare Rifts. And you will just need to kill the 16 quest mobs for your Nightmare Daily quest. Use the power-ups wisely and try to EV as much as you can. This can be done really quickly if you know what you're doing. This is also a great opportunity if you have no idea what the power-ups do. Just read the tooltip and learn to work with them. There's nothing worse than opening a Nightmare Rift and seeing people just wasting power-ups because they have no idea what they're doing. So once you killed your 16 quest mobs, you can exit the training ground. Now this bit is really important. Do not hand in the rapid eye movement quest, the story quest. You only hand in the daily quest. By not handing in the rapid eye movement quest, you will be able to enter the training grounds every day. So you just need to log in, take the daily, port inside the dungeon, kill your mobs and you're done. No need to look for a rift anymore. I did this daily for a couple of days now, it's on 4 characters on 6 different shards. It takes about 40 minutes to do them all. You get 2 illusion remotes per daily quest, so with 4 characters on 6 shards that's 48 modes a day. 
please put a like on the video if you enjoyed it, and don't forget to subscribe for future uploads. And as always, thanks for watching!